Good, my boy. Good. Athena has chosen wisely. I knew it was so. Who are you? So, you have the blades, the skin as pale as the moon. You are the one indeed. Perhaps Athens will survive at that. <laughs> but be careful. Don't want you dying before I'm done with this grave. A grave? In the middle of a battle? Who will occupy it, old man? You will, my son. Oh, I've got a lot of digging to do indeed. All will be revealed in good time. And when all appears to be lost, Kratos, I will be there to help. Don't disturb me now, son. I've got my work to do, and you have yours. And precious little time left to do either.
And with that act, Kratos set in motion the events that would lead to his downfall. Kratos, as Athena herself has foretold. But you are late, perhaps too late to save Athens. Or is it Athens you have come to save? No, I, I can't! We must not stop! And when the Oracle no, looked into his soul, she saw a beast as well as a man. Once a captain in the Spartan army, Kratos had begun his command with only 50 soldiers. But soon his numbers grew to the thousands. His tactics were brutal, but effective. Drunk with power, he was feared by all, except one. His wife was the only one to brave his fury. How much is enough, Kratos? When will it end? When the glory of Sparta is known throughout the world. The glory of Sparta. You did this for yourself. His desire for conquest knew no bounds. But that which he desired would ultimately consume him. By the gods, why would Athena send one such as you? Stay out of my head! Choose your enemies wisely, Kratos. Your brute strength alone will not be enough to destroy Ares. Only one item in the world will allow you to defeat a god. Pandora's box, which lies far beyond the walls of Athens, hidden by the gods across the desert to the east. But be warned, Kratos. Many have gone in search of Pandora's box. None have returned. Go through the gates to the desert, Kratos. There begins the path to Pandora's box. It is the only way you will defeat Ares and save Athens.